Cups and condiments were flying, customers and employees physically fighting at a local restaurant, and it was all caught on camera. And as our Jason Hibbs reports, police are using this viral video to send what could be a life saving message. Yeah, Jory, the video, it was shot on Friday just after 7 at the Lee Mall. It's been viewed 164,000 wow. times with the Columbus wow. police chief. He says he's disturbed by what he sees and is not just talking about the fight itself. In addition to this viral video shot by a mall customer, the owner of American Deli showed us his footage captured by his surveillance cameras. Police say it all started when a customer's credit card was declined and that customer's two daughters didn't like the way the employees were treating their mother. You can see someone, police say that's a daughter, try to hop over the counter as an employee starts hurling drinks at her. Police say this is the other daughter who makes her way behind the counter and they start fighting. And as you can see from this cell phone video, another person is throwing items at employees behind the counter. And then this person, police say the other daughter, stands on the counter and starts assaulting the employees involved in the fight. Police say the fighting only stopped because one of the daughters had a seizure and fell to the floor. So what would you do if you're shopping in a place like this, minding your own business, and a fight breaks out? I'd try to get away from it. Yeah, it depends if they get jumped or not. Watch it. Watch it. That's the answer. That's absolutely the wrong thing to do. Call the police. Call the police because, again, we're talking about lives. We're talking about someone that could get, get seriously hurt. Columbus Police Chief Fred Shelton says he's thankful no one pulled a weapon. And while the cell phone video could serve as evidence, he says people should always call 911 first. In this instance, he says someone called for an ambulance before anyone called for police. Everybody want to get it on video. Everybody want to send it around. Make the call. You can get your video, but make the call first. And customers said that they wouldn't call police, Jory. They say they don't want their name out there. They don't want to get involved. But the police chief says that in most cases, you can remain anonymous. Some witnesses, of course, would be called to court to mm -hmm. testify. So let's ask this. I think this is something everyone's wanting to know. Will any charges be filed in this case? Yeah, well, the owner of that restaurant, he doesn't want to press charges. Okay. He says he just wants all of this behind him. But the police chief says that the employee could press assault charges if she wanted to. Meanwhile, police, okay. they are considering charging the two with disorderly conduct. That means a misdemeanor and a small fine. All right, well, thank you, Jason. We've also reached out to the mall manager. He declined to comment. The American deli owner said mall security did respond to this incident.